Today we're going to be making smoked spaghetti and meatballs. Now, the spaghetti itself is not actually smoked, but the meat is, and it will impart its flavor onto the sauce. I'm going to show you how that's done. For the meatballs, we're going to put in one onion. We're going to dice it fine, and we're going to add this to the ground beef. One eternity later. Yeah. You might be wondering why we add onions to the meatballs. It's so that they don't lose moisture because they're going to get both smoked and they're going to get cooked in the sauce. And a lot of people use fillers, bread and milk and things like that, but I I like to use onions. One egg. Take a fork. Mix up the egg. Some dried parsley. You can use fresh too. Um, I don't have any fresh right now, so using dried. Quarter cup of grated parm. You can use any kind of grated parm you want makes no difference. It's all personal preference. Break up the big chunks. And only the people that want to watch TV by recording a video, and last but not least, add your meat. Okay, take your meat, mix it up. And there we go, all the meatballs. Hot Italian sausage in natural casing. A few hours later. Let's see what our sauce looks like. All right, our sauce is nice and cooked down. It's not burnt on the bottom. Now time to add some flavor from the smoke. These meatballs have to finish cooking. They are not anywhere near ready. They're just smoked. And this is where the smokiness will come from, is these have been on the grill for over for an hour and a half. Now, they're gonna be nice and smoky. And that'll get imparted into the sauce. Okay. All right. And now, let it cook for an hour or so. Our sauce is perfect. The sausage and the meatballs are all fully cooked. Smoke's really coming through from having been out there and the sauce is the consistency that I want it. We're gonna do angel hair. It's gonna be good. I like the angel hair pasta, it cooks quickly and I like the fine texture. I do not put oil in my pasta because as anyone who's watched the Food Network should know, putting oil in your pasta will cause the sauce not to stick. 
take your drained pasta into the pot it goes that's all there is to it isn't that beautiful perfect now nothing's gonna stick so now you can turn around put the lid on put a lid on it Leave that right there. All right. Sauce. Whoops. All right, and that is how you do it.